Hello wood turners, my name is Mark, welcome in the shop. Today I don't have a project, a wood turning project for you, but uh, I have some tips that I want to share with you, so uh, let's go with uh, tip number one. want to uh, share with you, this is my, uh, my, uh, my sealer, I use that as a sealer. My uh, problem is uh, the, the, the cap, if I may say. And uh, I, I, it is always a challenge to uh, to uh, work with that. My tip is uh, you you take a flat screwdriver and you uh, you pop off the white cap in a moment. This is live action at camera. Et voilà. And now you have a, a normal screw. Uh, I'm not sure of the English word, but it works. It works fine, and no, no problem whatsoever. Tips uh, number two: You are looking uh, looking at a strip, a white strip of plastic, and I will, uh, in a moment, shoot. Uh, adhesive uh, glue if it works voilà. and, uh, so and in the glued to the the strips 120 150 180 now this is my uh, my work in progress. This is uh, the bottom of a, of a box. This is olive wood. But uh, my problem is that uh, here, here, on the points, I have uh, ridges that I need to remove. Uh, I'm afraid to chuck, chuck, chuck that, chuck this, and uh, to use tools because uh, I will have to go super fast and uh, if uh, something wrong uh, happen, I may uh, be, uh, I may lose uh, some of the points. So I will use a, a instead sandpaper. So I'm uh, I'm running through, and uh, with my strips, I will come here and I will sand gently uh, my points, and uh, uh, I'll not show you the the process, but uh, I'll show you the result. If it works, I uh, I change my mind. I will send a, a bit in front of you. Let's go. thing about the strip it uh, is that uh, you can uh, bend uh, the, 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 the strips the strip for uh, uh, the, the points here so uh, I, I will have some more sending to do but by hand so uh, the, the strip trick works well another another thing that uh, works well for me is uh, those uh, pre-made uh, jam chuck uh, with my collection of uh, Forstner bit uh, which is, this one was used uh, to uh, create my hole here and uh, for each uh, Forstner bit I made a jam chuck with the corresponding uh, tenon and uh, so uh, I can uh, use that uh, on the spot be careful not to force. My tenon is a hair bigger, so I have a fit, a close, a close fit, and uh, you don't want to crack the the wall of the box. And uh, this end, uh, if uh, I have my spigot jaws, the hole is used, and if I have the number two jaws, uh, 
uh, the outside is uh, so whatever jaws I use uh, I can uh, go with my uh, pre-made uh, jam chuck uh, on the spot okay sorry for the the headless guy uh, my uh, last tip this uh, polymerized tongue oil sealer is a, war is a joy to work with the only problem uh, is that uh, with, uh, cont with uh, hair contact the, the oil will congeal don't know if uh, I pronounced the thing right and uh, they, uh, I, I bought this uh, uh, plastic pouch with uh, in French is a goulot and I have a cap here and uh, what you can do is uh, pour your uh, your finish in the pouch and remove the hair now I have something here that uh, I'll not show you and after that I will show you uh, I will demonstrate how I can I can remove the hair from the the bag okay you have to build uh, this little uh, jig and uh, with the bag comes uh, uh, plastic tubes and everything so uh, you plug the thing right there and there you go Now, all my uh, finish is in the back. I'll change your position. So, oxygen is your enemy with that. So, for uh, the hair removing, simply, I just uh, squeeze the bag in my vise. Longer uh, uh, piece of wood would be better but for the visuality I'll show you so and sometimes you have to uh, to play with the bag and slowly you may have to uh, to squeeze the corners. I have a hair here. Hair is out. And the hair is back. You have to be gentle. There you go. And now, by high, you squeeze until you reach the top. Like this. You have to be careful. Now, cap the thing, and there you go, no hair, and uh, I'm, uh, I'm supposed to be good for a long time, so uh, that's it. You know sometimes I need uh, a thin strip of uh, uh, paper, sometimes medium, sometimes big, so uh, I'll try something uh, before uh, in front of you and uh, we'll see. Let's go!
I think I'm good. Let's try another one. It's only paper, so uh, I'll squeeze it. Even better. All right, so I have my my thin, my medium, and my big. Wow, a little bit of a thing here. Nothing to worry about. Okay, guys and girls, this is uh, what I have to share for today. Keep safe, be safe in the shop, and uh, see you another time. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe.